Hey guys, and welcome back to Monster Hunter Rise. Today I'm going to show you how to take buddies out of the buddy dojo. A bunch of people have been commenting saying they don't know how to do this. So when you go to the buddy dojo right over here, you can see I've got a few buddies in there. Chops, Musicals, Andrew, blah, 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 blah. Right? So you can see Chops is already max level 35 because that's the highest level you can reach right now. So him being in training is completely pointless. So I'm going to go into the buddy dojo and... People are like, how do you get them out? So the way you get them out is actually go to select buddies and then obviously Pelamutes because Chops is a Pelamute. And you can see any of the names that are in yellow will mean they are currently in training over here. You can see Chops here is in training. All I have to do is reselect him and it will actually take him out of the training details. And now I can put another one in. I'm going to put Rocky in, for example. And if I go to my Pelicos by pressing R, you can see Musicals, Andrew, Origami, Bruce, and Yamato are all in training. And if I wanted to take them out, the same applies. I just press A, and you can see it takes them out one by one. And I can literally put whoever I want in there. If I only want to train Rocky for some reason, which would be pointless because you can train six at a time, and you should try get as many level 35s as you can in this game. Now the whole purpose of getting these buddies to level 35 is mainly for like things like the Argosy where you can do the buddy trading, the buddy bargaining is what I mean here. And you can press the X here. I'm going to go uh, shiny bargain for you. You can see here there's different types of bargains that you can do here that will bring a different amount of special rewards depending on the level of your buddy that is in the Argosy. And obviously the Argosy doesn't give you experience while you're in here. So what I'll actually do is go to a trade request and I'll take wheat out of here. What a weird name. And I'm going to put chops in here. I'm going to put him over there, right? And I want him to, to hunt for, for Mighty Seeds, okay? Once we've confirmed that and I've put my level 35 chops right there at the top of the thing, you can go to Buddy Bargaining. And if I select here, you can see I can select every type of bargaining skill over here. Breakneck Bargain, which engages in relentless haggling, greatly increasing the items obtained in a short time. So you can farm items very quickly with this one over here, but only for those three little kind of like stars. But if you use the Lagney Apple, you make that to six. So you increase the odds of like how fast he's going to break stuff in so he's going to bring in those might seeds way quicker than Icarus and you the other two buddies in here another major reason to have your buddies on level 35 is actually the meowcenaries right over here to actually be able to have a higher expected outcome so they'll bring back better rewards or more rewards for doing the the rampages or the quests that you send them on you can see here i've got an expected outcome of five out of five but i can only do four that fifth one is actually because of the lagni apple and i want to get to a point where all of those uh buddies the four buddies on this quest are all level 35 so that they can bring back the highest expected outcome without me having to use any lagni apples so leveling up all your buddies to 35 increases everything that you can farm in the game at higher rates so that you can just make life easier for, for endgame or getting certain materials, items, or anything that you're looking for. I hope this video was helpful, and I'll see you guys in a future one. Thank you so much for watching.